Okay. Mm. All right, you guys. It's actually not morning. It is definitely in the afternoon. It will, in fact, be dark soon. So we're going to have to do an inside playtime and or treadmill for their second amount. But right here, what we're going to do is we're going to do... Um, hold on, let me see what Jack's doing because I think he, she's being real extra. See, the thing with Jack is that she she plays real rough. She plays real rough immediately. Um, but she is the first one to get upset when Kratos starts playing rough the same way, right? So she's not doing too bad. No tackling. Jack! enough ah. girl so basically when Kratos decided to correct her like she did in the last video um I'm gonna let it happen because Jack's extra Whew. but yeah so basically 15 minutes at least with Kratos and Jack and then 15 minutes with Kratos and Samara. Um, I'm doing this way because Kratos is the one who needs all the energy out. Jack, like, as in, I, like, literally, I could go all day without Jack doing anything. Um, if she was the only dog in the house. She does tend to get excited with other dogs around. Um, but she could go all day without playing and she'd be well-behaved in the house, right? Um, Kratos needs to burn energy. I mean, the doggles just need to do that, so. Um, oh, look at that. That's what she gets to do. I'm trying to tackle people. <laughs> so yeah, 15 minutes was uh, at least 15 minutes. It, the thing is, is that when it was warmer outside, they got tired a lot easier, right? Now that it's cooler, you know, that heat's not adding any kind of pressure to their playtime. I guess it's probably not the rest, best way to say it, but you know what I mean. Hey Jack. Yeah, so tomorrow I'll be next, but I do want her to, um, I do want her to be outside with them. Um, just because I, when she's in the house, she's, okay, lately, I guess I can start with this. Lately, Samara, and I haven't done anything different, like, nothing's different's happened, but lately, of course, Jack wants to potty outside the freaking crate. Um, Jack does have a tendency to not poop unless she's been out for a while, um, so... That's his name. Uh, let him use the bathroom. Yeah, he's peeing. Not as nice as her, though. Could not bother him while he's pooping. <laughs> or peeing, I mean. No way, their paws will be wiped. Oh, she was trying to pee, but I guess she got distracted. There she goes. We better finish using the bathroom, girl. Oh, so she got poop hanging off her butt. Finish using the bathroom. Kratos, no. Well, this dude was just not inside. Hey, leave her be so she can potty in peace. Pretty boy. Pretty boy. Oh, he's young. Ah, Jack. Jack, no. Don't play games with me, little boy. I literally just said no. Um, yeah, they both of them just came from inside. All three of them came from inside. What am I talking about? So there's no reason for they need to drink the nasty pond water when they had fresh water inside the house. But I'm saying they get so excited that they forget about stuff. Hey, Jack! Enough! I mean, I need to put the e-collar on Jack. Or an e-collar on Jack. There's one inside the house. But she's being a little extra. But yeah, anywho, anyway, um, oh yeah, back to Samara, I'll talk about Samara. Basically, not doing anything different, lately Samara has been, um, being very needy, and so the over two Mastiffs are very, um, they are GoPro dogs, they want to be by your side all the time, they don't like not being by your side. Um, however, that being said, as puppies, like Samara's age, puppies, um, uh, or younger, I guess, um, they tend to be really distractible, really doing what they want to do, or whatever. Not really whole, all into the whole, um... I'm really waiting for Kratos to correct. 
You guys know he can, but Kratos has to be in a position where he can't run from the correct, which is which is an issue, right? He needs to correct him, like, just based, just in general. Like, if somebody, the dog's doing something wrong, he needs to correct, not just when he can't run away. Ah! No. Jack, you either. Get. Move. Good girl. I'm glad that they're getting tired. They're just kept panting. You see? See that behavior? Jack is incredibly real. I'm really waiting for Kratos to correct her. And Kratos is still young, so... But yeah, so, um, after Samara- or after Kratos, uh, Kratos and Jack are done, I want to let uh, Kratos and Samara get done. Um, if I was doing Samara and Jack, I put the collar on Samara. Or, I, not the Samara, Samara has a collar on. And I won't need it for Playtime Samara, because Samara is a good girl. Um, but I would put the collar on Jack for sure. Yeah. So hopefully when Kratos gets older, he'll be better at it. He'll be better at being like, okay, look, I'm not about to run away from you. I'm going to stay on my ground just back off, but... Um, next time I'll know for sure when I do this tomorrow that Jack needs to have her e-collar on because she's just, just being extra. Samara being excited. Ready girl, you're next. Seven minutes in. Hey, relax though. Let me do anything you ain't supposed to be doing. Jack's gonna need. Yeah. So I guess the thing is, is that Kratos has only, so far, has only corrected Jack when Jack's tried to correct her. So Kratos has never corrected Jack just for being high energy, right? Is when Jack gets an attitude is when Kratos gets an attitude. Or, I mean, not all the times, but, you know, well, the times that he has actually corrected her, that's been the only times. It's when she has an attitude and she's suddenly trying to correct him, um, is when Kratos is like, okay, look, no, you're not about to correct me. Um, so, which is, it's, it's kind of ridiculous. I don't know if you guys noticed. You see Jack laying down, or he was laying down. Um, I don't know if you guys noticed, but Kratos has a lot of, like, dark spots in, you can probably, you might be able to tell, actually, I don't know. I actually, like, my quality of my video is pretty bad. Um, my camera's kind of crappy, guys. But I've told you guys that. Um, so I'm gonna try to get a closer look at them. even though they're definitely gonna hop out. Start running around by the time I get up here. Possibly. Yeah, they, they have been playing for quite a while. <clears throat> yeah, you guys can't really tell, but you saw that dark mark on his, on his side of his face. Um, I think? I think I thought I checked to make sure it was, it was visible, but I don't know. Like, most of that's just dirt. But did you see that? Maybe that mark by his face is on him. I'm sorry now. Yeah, they're cute. One of these days, I'm going to get a video with all of them out. But it's definitely going to have to be a day where they're already tired. It can't be beforehand for sure. So I'm trying to fix I want to get a video. I want to get a. Um, not a video, but I want to get a picture of them all together. Are you guys tired? Are you doing some stick chilling? I'll say, still 15 minutes for them, so that's what they want to do for the next couple minutes. Great. Great. Um. But yeah, anyway, lately Samara's been, um, just needy. Um, and when she was younger, so I guess right when she was four months old and then younger, she was just too distracted wanting to play that she really didn't necessarily care, uh, where I was, right? So, um, if that made sense. But now, I can, if I'm about the room and she's like in a, in her pen or in a crate or whatever, if she can't see me, she starts crying, which is like, nothing's changed, but... She's starting to get that kind of, um, that kind of, um, oh, that girl is also dead. Uh, she also starting to get that kind of, um, velcro that comes with the Dogar to Damascus. So, and Kratos, he's better at it, but he still, sometimes he still feels that way, you know? If he's behind a pen, 
Uh, he's from behind the gate, I guess. And I'm, you know, if I walk away, uh, sometimes he will be like, um, right, let's see that all that growling is jack. Like the thing is, is I don't, I probably said this before, but I probably said it a long time ago. But one of the reasons why I don't really correct Jack in a lot of things is because she, she's a spade female. There is no way once my t my dogos are mature and adults, there's no way that they're gonna allow this behavior from her. They're just, just not. So they're gonna be issuing her own corrections. But I mean, I do appreciate them being respectful and being like, okay, this this dog's acting like a butt. Let me just leave her alone. But realistically, like when they're adults, Jack's gonna be getting all the corrections, and so. Um, she needs to recognize that she, I mean, she's not the boss. I mean, you guys won't see this inside the house, like, just normally. Jack, Jack is really calm and everything, but, um, you know, out here, she has, she's trying to burn all the energies when she loses her mind a bit, as you guys can you tell, but, anyway. But, yeah. But I am actually kind of, I'm pretty, oh, I don't know if I'm snake, y'all. I'm pretty, um, confident that... All my dogs, um, all my dogos will be pretty, um, balanced when it comes to corrections. I can say that much. Um, I, I'm, I, right now anyway, I'm very confident that when they are ready to issue corrections, they'll be pretty balanced in doing it. I'm not going to go overboard or anything like that. Once they're mature enough. Right now, okay, so just kind of, he's really lenient. Um, he's incredibly lenient and he shouldn't, he shouldn't be. <laughs> but he's a puppy still, so... Yeah, I don't know if you guys can, I don't know, my, you can kind of see on the side of his face where it's a little darker right there. So those are, technically those are from Samara, um, Kratos, when he gets excited inside the house, um, when he, where he can't really run, um, he decides to try to hump, and Samara is kind of the only dog that I have that will actually correct him, and look, Kratos kind of, I did, I did talk about this, I tell about how he just, he just sat there and chewed on her face, or he just sat there and let Samara chew on his face, which, you know, hence the scarring. But it's scabbing, but um, yeah. Anyway, Kratos kind of takes a lot from the puppies, from the from the girls right now. But I don't imagine he's gonna do that forever, especially when he comes to mature meal. But um, yeah, anyway, guys, um, that's basically it. Mm. I'm hoping that they'll be tired after this, but to be honest, I don't know. Okay, I'm actually gonna bring this down. Kratos, Kratos, what about me? Jeez. Oh, all right. I'm actually not entirely sure how I got there, but did I put it up there? I don't know. But um, this is a good way for them to burn energy. The strong stuff, you know, is fine, but I need them to actually get tired when they're inside the house. So I can relax. Um, I don't know. I, this today, you guys saw the video of this earlier, but today basically. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if Kratos actually corrects her during this, too. That she's being like, oh, that whole paw thing is really weird. Okay, Kratos, uh, just accepted a correction from her. He won't keep doing that, though. I, I will tell you, that he's not going to keep accepting corrections from her. Um, and I also to mention, like, Kratos, um, he has, like, he has all the scarring from playtime, right? So, dogs, the, the girls play rough, he kind of bears the scars from that. He never puts any, any markings on the other dogs. Never. The girls are kind of crazy. He's just kind of accepting of it. Too accepting of it right now, but, um, you know, I can't say that much. So, anyway, I just want them to burn some energy. I don't want them to kind of sit and relax out here chewing on a stick. I need them to be tired. <laughs> so they can behave inside the house. Yeah, all that snarling from Jack. Jack's a pit bull, by the way. Anybody who's new. I do have their ages and names in the description. You guys want to know? Luckily, I only have one. Um, I, have, I have two dogos, but they're opposite sex, so, you know, pretty easy to fall apart. Also, different, um, different sizes at the moment. They don't look alike. Besides the fact that they're white dogs, so. Different sizes and, and everything. Kratos got a nice old blockhead. Kratos, can you not chew on that part of the thing? It's like, I'm trying to break it off. Yeah, but anyway. 
I'm gonna let it go for another five minutes just because I do want them to spend. All right, sorry you guys. Um, my phone's crap. I mentioned that I came out here originally. Originally, I came out here with 70% on my my phone, and I left offloaded everything off my phone. I even deleted two apps so I could just re-download and log in, um, just so that I can have the storage to record. And not only did they had no storage at the end of their video, which I did, they did finish their, their timeout for 20 minutes, but um, I just didn't get the whole thing on record. Um, so not only did it say I had no storage, it also died on me. And then when I plugged it back in a minute ago, it said, oh, you had 8% on my phone. Okay, it's just, it's just kind of ridiculous, y'all. Just a little bit. <laughs> Don't drink that nasty water, girl. You were just a fat too. Okay, so mostly here, we'll be using the e-collar. For Kratos. So, hey. Kratos, gentle. Okay, hold on. Okay, see, that's a good thing. I actually don't know if she's actually used that yet, so that would be nice for him to introduce her and introduce that to her. So he's just got to recognize that, okay, another female, while well, she's almost the size of Jack, she is not yet, and she's also very young. So he's, he's slowly starting to get to correct his behavior. Um,. Samara? No. No, Mars. Good jeez. Now, I will say Jack just finished the water inside, so I'm gonna have to give him some more water when they go in, when these two go in. The water bowl is empty, but they, they just came from inside, y'all. Ah, you can't jump that yet, can you, Mars? <laughs> she will. Hi! Hi, Mars! I know. Hi, pretty girl. It's like, I can't do that yet. She probably could. Um, but she's gonna have to try it. You gonna try it, ma'am? You can't squeeze through there. You're too big. Hi, Mars. <laughs> I just like, yeah, I got the stick back here. What you gonna do? All right, y'all. So like I said, I, just, I charged it. I got it back to 20%. But I don't know how long it's going to last, to be honest. My phone. I haven't mentioned my phone is crap lately. Because it is. I've had this phone for like three years. I wish the useful life on cell phones <laughs> was longer than a couple years. Like, honestly, I feel like the phone... Like, I, I don't know anything about technology like that. So I don't know if it's the device itself. Oh, Kratos, you cannot take that with you. I don't know if it's the device itself or it's just like the data. Well, that's good to mess out of me. So I was looking at the dinosaur here. I was like, what the heck is going on? Um, so I don't know if it's the data or it's in my phone itself. But if it's the data and it's not like the hardware, right? Or the, the hard drive. Um, I feel like the phone needs to last forever. Like, you know, like if, if it's just like the software of it. I don't even know if I'm using those words right. I'm pretty sure hardware is an actual physical phone. I feel like unless that's malfunctioning, the phone should be fine. You gonna do it? Come on, Jack. Er, I thought you, Jack. Come on, Mars. You can do it, girl. Show her how it's done, Kratunes. Good boy. <laughs> Give me a little show off. She can do it. I mean, you guys see how she jumps. She can do it. She just gotta, you know, build the confidence and give it a try. So, unfortunately, in puppy class, I mean, you guys seen her in puppy class. So all the agility stuff that she they do, none of it's our, none of it is her hurdles. Well, somebody's burning leaves. On them, it's hurdles, so um, so we haven't actually tried to do that, but I'm I'm certain that she could do it if she gave it a try. So, okay, so you will get in trouble immediately for trying to drink that water. <laughs> Pretty boy, I cannot tell you guys. I'm hoping that they pass their health inspections. But temperament-wise, I cannot wait to have a, a male dog that has, like, Samara's temperament. Maybe a bit more, because Kratos has been in- Kratos is the easiest dogo I've ever dealt with, by far. Uh, at least as, as a youngster, I guess. Kratos, Samara's definitely a lot more stubborn, but, um, like, Samara's just- she's so strong-willed, she's so confident, um, she's, she's a good girl. She's a good girl. So I cannot wait to have, um, you know, a male that kind of has her personality. But Kratos, unfortunately, I don't know, unfortunately, Kratos has the better looks, just in Dogo-wise. And let me, I don't know if I mentioned this before, but I'm an amateur when it comes to Dogos. These are my first two. Um, so, 
you know, I there's a lot that I will learn from these dogs, but um, I don't know. I love this angle. It looks like Samara's uh, teeth look better. But like I said, she has um, an underbite, which is not standard. They need to have a scissor bite, which is basically their top teeth and bob teeth need to be touching each other. Not none, Nothing needs to be pushed forward or pushed back. Um, and Kratos has perfect teeth. Um, and Samara also has an out-of-standard spot on her back. It's really hard to notice, but basically, like, the Dilgar Shimasa, except for on their face and out of- ah, 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 Samara, no. I know, girl, but you just came inside from the house. My Dilgars are the most thirsty dogs. I know, Morris. It's hard. Hi, Bobby. Hi, girl. She's like, hey, I can go from this angle you won't see me get water. <laughs> What are you doing? You can go potty, girly. Even though you had time to potty inside the crate. Or inside the, the pen. But yeah, she has a basically uh, for standard. I don't know if you can see that spot on her back. No, you guys can't. She is super bright on my phone. Good jeez. <laughs> she has a spot on her back where it's actually dark fur. It's black fur. And they can have um, a spot on their face, so long as it's like, I think it's under a quarter. I think it depends on where it is, too. I'm not actually entirely sure. I have to look at the standard a little bit more. Um, I'm not showing any of these dogs, because they're both not perfect in my... And, I mean, they're young, right? They're still young, but still, Kratos doesn't have the personality to be a show dog. He gets really anxious when he's away from me. Um, we're actually gonna... And I don't know when. I need to find a good a good place to do it, but I, I want him to have, spend a day at a um, boarding facility where he just works with random people like you know strangers recently working with him uh, that way he can just gain confidence um but anyway outside of that uh he doesn't really have the personality to be a show dog and he's not he's i don't think he's a perfect dog though you know um he looks like he's still younger he's still young so maybe when he matures and he reaches the three age mark where i've heard that they finish kind of growing and maturing maybe he'll look perfect but from what i can tell now he's he's a little He's not perfect. Oh, you guys are peeing together. How cute. Um, so, you know, so neither one of these these babies is going to be show dogs, but hopefully one of their offsprings, or one of their grandchildren anyway, um, hopefully they will be, be show lines. So, but we'll see. We'll have to wait and see what, uh, what they bring when, if they're health tests and everything, but, um, but yeah. Alrighty, well... I don't really have much else to talk about. Well, to, earlier today, Samara, um, I made a video about it, which posted earlier, which will actually post today. Today is Friday, is Black Friday for anybody who, who knows. You guys won't see this until Sunday. Um, basically, um, Samara, 4 a.m. this morning, she pooped on herself inside the kennel in the house, and then right after breakfast, she peed on herself. Uh, so we've had a kind of a, an L day. She's kind of backpacked in her potty training, but. Basically, like I said, I would do in the video, which I'll, I'll get a, I'll have done a summary on it anyway, but um, basically she had spent some time in that kennel after she went, after I cleaned it up. I basically put her back in there, after I washed her down too, put her back in there for about the same time until her next potty break, which had been when she came out um, earlier. And then, so she had no accident, so she she's free to come inside the house um, once they're done playing. So, um, hi! I know you're trying to get some water. Hello! Hi, Lawrence. She's so cute. Hello! My baby Goonies has outgrown me. He's like, no, I'm busy lady. I don't know what he's doing. Honestly, the squirrels are forever bringing stuff inside the yard. Um, there's actually, I think there's some bread stuck between the, um, a fence post because the squirrels always bring stuff in the yard. So he's probably spilling some of that stuff. Also, it's been quite a while. You're not getting water. You need to sit pretty, pretty lady. Look at her. No. My poor girl. My dogs are forever thirsty. My poor girl. Alright, y'all. I'm surprised my phone lasted this long, to be completely honest. Hopefully I can get at least maybe 12 minutes out of it. She's, she's waiting for me to release her so she can get some water. I'm sorry, Mars. You can't. I can't, Mars. I'm sorry. You can't have that water. And I will not let her drink water until we get inside the house, simply because... She has only a couple minutes left, and it takes it takes some time to grab their bowl, bring it out here, fill it with water, and all that other stuff. And I also, um, Dilgarshi Masses are- ah, ah, no. Dilgarshi Masses aren't prone to bloat, um, but it doesn't mean they can't get it, right? They're not one of those dogs that are, like, really prone to bloat. Like, for example, Great Danes, um, they can suffer from bloat, 
And basically that's when after a dog has eaten or drunk water or whatever, if they do too much of an activity, um, basically their intestines can flip and it can be life-threatening. Um, if you don't know what's going on like immediately, right? So, and even though Diller Chimassives aren't technically prone to that from what I've read and heard, I'm not about to take any chances. They're large, they're large breed dogs. Uh, we make sure that they're okay. So I don't want to, especially since they drink so much water, these two right here, I don't want to, um, you know, risk that. That's with Kratos since he's the biggest. Um, so we'll see. Oh, clumsy girl. I might put this in the other video together in one video. It might be for the best. They're both kind of shorter. <sighs> oh, we got some... Hey, 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 watch it. And you guys know some might be running into people. Y'all seen her play videos. I'm not just going and not looking where she's going. Well, hope you guys have had a nice um, Black Friday and Thanksgiving holiday. Um, oh, it's getting cold. So yeah, I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow. I want to take some more out tomorrow and go somewhere. I didn't want to do it today because it's Black Friday and it's a little crazy. I wanted to get a, at least have a little bit of a normal weekend, even though there might be people returning stuff tomorrow. Kratos. Okay, he wasn't too bad. He was a little, little rough, but not too bad. Um, so this is 24 hours after the video you guys just saw, or the beginning part of this video anyway. Um, the dogs have played only once so far today. They'll play again tonight before I go to sleep. Um, but I kind of had the same... Ex I, I tried to record a video after yesterday's video, which is a video you guys just saw. Oh, they basically sleep like they are now. I mean, Samara's not really sleepy. Look at her. Um, but it, the video got lost. I'm not sure how. It was so good. They're all cute and sleep. It was great. I mean, they're kind of cute and sleep here. <laughs> Except for Samara, who's over there peeking. Um, but anyway, yeah, my story just is crap. I mean, I've said it before. So my apologies for that. But I do hope that you guys enjoyed the video. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.